Today I will show you all my small application which runs a network of agents which are using large language models to perform some research in the internet. So here we have my graphic card and here we will see all those open source large language models I have hosted on my PC. So everything is running on-prem, so I am able to select those models here to perform my tasks for rewriting some text. So first of all, I have to write down what my three agents have to do for me. So that's the um, task they have to perform. And yeah, so I'm interested in the um, last um, flight of the um, starship so let us write the task down here so what i'm interested in some information about that um, flight from um, spacex all right that looks good so here are the general tasks so they are describing what the task is so I have a task for the researcher agent, I have a task for the author writer agent, and I have a task for the business angel. So all those tasks are described in a way that they are about startups who are active in generative AI and for the finance industry. So as well, the author is interested in such um, technologies and startups and as well the business angel wants to invest in startups active in the finance sector using generative ai so i have to rewrite that that three tasks so yeah here are the um, agents so that's a researcher with its rule goal and backstory so yeah, he's a senior research analyst. We have the business angel. And here you see the same setup, role, goal, and backstory of that um, agent. And we have the author who's writing the um, text or the blog post article at the end. So as you see here as well, I have that drop-down menu where I'm able to select those open source models. So Mistral is working very good. Open Hermes is good for the DuckDuck Go search. So let's start, I would guess. So yeah, we use that. Open Hermes model, here we see the usage of the GPU. And now press start generation. So first of all, the task will be rewritten for the author, for the researcher and for the business angel so that looks not so good for the researcher so they had failed to rewrite um, the tasks but for the author and for the business angel it's all about spacex and the flight of the starship so on the right side in the terminal window we see the usage of the gpu and here on the left side we see the agent network working so it's performing and um, the research tasks via the DuckDuck go search and yeah that takes a little bit time so we have to wait for that but at the end it's quite fast faster um, than when i would have done it by my own and here we go so that's the um, short text introduction, background, key moments of that flight. So it looks, looks really, really cool. And as well, a conclusion. So yeah, I like it. So that will save me a lot of time. So let's try again, because that um, description of the researcher was not so good, was all about AI startups in the finance sector. So just press generation once again, and hopefully now the task will be rewritten. No, ah, here we go. So there is something regarding Starship and SpaceX. So 
yeah, maybe my conversational application in the background needs some tweaking at that point. But overall, it it looks looks really really um, good what the results are produced. So hopefully now you will get as well a nice story about the um, third flight, I guess, third flight of the um, Starship. So here we see it's running and here we go. Yeah. Well, the date, the date was not correct, but overall it's a nice text. So it's not perfect, not perfect. Maybe the ground truth is not so good here. So I have maybe think about my, my prompt rewriting that it does not create um, things um, which are not not true. So yeah, that's that's something I have to to look into it. So let's check how drones are reshaping the aviation industry in, in case of, of human transportation. So hopefully now the three tasks will be rewritten in a proper way that we could could use them for for that um, analysis, so check that history for human transport. Yeah, that looks good for the research uh, for the outdoor as well. With um, M, M joys and transportation yeah, for the business angel, it looks also that it is going in the good direction, but not really in investing money. So you will see. Here we see the um, network working, so it's performing those um, search queries um, via DuckDuckGo search and collecting the, the information and, and working working with that. And the GPU the graphic card is running around about 90%. Here we had a short switch, um, I think, between between those large language models. So maybe the the author was crafting the um, final final text. How drones are reshaping the aviation industry, and yeah, I think I think if you're a student at school, high school, or whatever, it could could save you a little bit a little bit time when you have to to um, prepare a speech or what to do an analysis. And here we have a short conclusion on the topic as well. Yeah. So let us try something else. Mm, not sure what we could, could search for. Mm. Maybe something about the weather, weather, you know, weather forecast for this year, for that summer, North America, Detroit. So that would be, would be nice if you could get some information on that. I'm not sure how good, how good the um, search will, will perform on that. Detroit region with the big lakes. That sounds interesting, so here we go. First of all, we have to rewrite our um, task descriptions. So weather forecast summer this year, North America, Detroit region. Uh, this, uh, uh, that, that looks good. And what is the business angel doing? Nothing regarding investments. So mm, that's, that's not perfect. But well, well, that's how it's going. So some code updates and tweaking is necessary here. So, but but overall, I'm I'm really happy with um, Crew AI as a framework which I'm using here with Olama as the um, hosting um, um, service server for my open source large language model. So I. Really, really like that that setup. It's working working quite quite well and is easy to to maintain and to update. So yeah, looking forward um, to use 
those techniques for um, new and updated um, applications in the field of conversational AI. Thank you very much for watching my video. See you.